Despite its landmark status, the Mississippi River contributes to the growing number of dead zones off the coast of the United States. By collecting materials from its surrounding states like fertilizer, sewage, wastewater, industrial and farmland runoff, and other pollution, there's a growing amount of nitrogen, phosphorus, and silica flowing in the water. The Mississippi River flows the contaminated water straight through Louisiana and into the Gulf of Mexico. The algae that populate the water columns there consume the nutrients and as a result, overpopulate. When algae die, they sink beneath the water where bacteria takes over and consumes the oxygen, thus rendering the area uninhabitable by marine life. This area becomes known as a dead zone because of hypoxia, or the lack of oxygen. And as shown in this map, the Mississippi River's influence transcends. Although it doesn't flow through Florida, the Gulf of Mexico pushes its water into the Straits of Florida.